Welcome back. Today's Tuesday and uh, Tuesday's our easy run. So we're doing just that today. Running nice and easy. Keeping the heart rate nice and low. Doing about six kilometers. Can't hold the camera like this all the way, so I'll take him with you at the end. That's the easy run done for today. 6.03 kilometers in 38 minutes, 36 seconds. So, yeah. See you again on Thursday for the session runs. I think we're going to be doing hill sprints this week. So, see you then. Good morning. Welcome back to the long run. And it's on a Saturday again. Nice and early today. Up past 6, 27, we've got out the door. Try and get it done nice and early today. We've got a little bit of shelter from the wind now with the trees. Yeah, so we've come out early today for a couple of reasons. First one, we've got things to do today. Second one is because I missed a run. My middle of the week hill sessions run and basically had a bad day at work, quite a physical job, things didn't go well in my eyes, like not for other people it might not have been a bad day but I had a bad day and it got to me and I'm at work for like 10 hours a day I'm walking home it's pissing down with rain I don't want to go for a run I'm not in the mood for a run and my mind beat me I didn't go I got home I sat down, ate my dinner had a bath and went to bed So this morning's early run is about beating my mind, getting up early on your day off, getting up, getting out and getting on that run. I can do it, I chose not to do it and we all have them battles. And that's okay. I think we need to have them battles sometimes. We can't win every battle. You can't win every battle. Oh, I've got a slight pull in my calf. Oh, let's try and stretch it out a little bit. Bit of a twinge. Yeah, we all have them battles time to time no one's invincible no one's got perfect mental health some people deal with it every day for a little bit and see if that eases up. I don't know what's happened there. When I lift my heel up, it just feels very tight. Oh, look. It's like that feeling you get when you press a bruise. We'll walk for a few minutes and uh, see how it goes if it's not any better, we might have to cut this run short. Right, called it. <laughs> it's not uh, it's not going away. So, I turned around and I'm walking home. I don't know what it is. Well, it's my calf. Like stretching in certain positions. Oh. I 
and I wasn't running fast, I was running slow. Okay, my first kilometer was actually pretty fast. I <laughs> didn't feel like I was going fast. I didn't look at my watch the whole time through. That was going to be my goal, was to just start the watch and just run to how my body feels. And it looks like I was getting that way because kilometer one, 518. Kilometer two was 632, so that's like my normal kind of average slow pace. And then kilometer three, 708, which we've got a bit of a gradient up here, so that again makes sense. So I came out a bit fast, but I settled down. I don't know. My calf didn't like something. And it's told me that. So three kilometer walk home. Hopefully it'll kind of ease up a little bit. If it doesn't ease up, I'll just get home, put a bit of ice on it, have a warm bath, and then we'll go back to the day. But yeah, I'm not gonna let it get me down. I'm not gonna let it beat me up. I won today. I got up early, I got out. I kind of understand why boxers do this now. A lot earlier than what I did today. They're up at like four, five o'clock in the morning. But I see, like, the, I've literally seen no one this morning. Saturday morning, everyone's still tucked up in bed. And I got out here for a run. It feels quite powerful, like, I'm working while you lot are still tucked up in bed. And I get that from a boxing mentality point. I'm getting more done than you are. I'm more prepared than you are. I do like my boxing. Anyway, we're digressing. <laughs> we talk about running, not boxing. So, as you could probably tell, I didn't finish my run. Um, I didn't have to walk all the way home either, actually. So, I I messaged my partner, who I left in bed, because I thought, if I go out nice and early, then she can have a lay-in. And it didn't work out that way for her. So, I, um, yeah, I sent her a message, told her that um, I pulled a muscle and that I was walking home. It's going to be home early. And, bless her, she came and picked me up like the gem that she is. Yeah, I walked up the road a little bit. She picked me up, went home, and now it still hurts. It's not um, it's not as bad as it was, but it's not great. It's not comfortable to walk on. I think I'm definitely gonna be out for a couple of days at least. We'll see how it goes. Next run's supposed to be on Tuesday, so we'll see how it feels. The reason I didn't sort of push for it to start with was from watching videos like This Messy Happy. They give a lot of info, advice and tips. They said if, you, if you've got pain while you're running, if it goes above, I think a three or a four, then just stop. It's not worth it. And you know what? They're 100% right. I mean, it started off as soon as as soon as soon I felt it, it was a, it was a four like straight away. It just went. It wasn't like a pop or anything like that. It just, pain was there. What can we do? There's no point in dwelling on it. It's happened. We just have to move forward. So, yeah, a few days rest. Take it easy. Take painkillers, ice it, rest it, lift it up. All the things you're supposed to do. Yeah, we'll just go again when it's when it feels better. Yeah, not not the videos I was expecting to make today. Expect the unexpected. <laughs> and from... Uh, I, d I don't know what's going on here, uh, Freddy, but... It seems like we're in sync with each other. Days that we're struggling to get out the door. We're both like getting injuries. Like we we we've synced up with each other. Something something's gone on mentally, and we're like conjoined <laughs> somehow. I don't know. I have to see some sort of positive in this. Like, but yeah, I hope your your legs getting better, mate. And uh, I don't know if you run today actually, because you said you were gonna you were gonna see how your leg was if you were to run today. I'll know when you're better. When I'm feeling better, eh? If my leg doesn't get better. If I'm not, if my leg doesn't get better, it's not going to fall off. Um, what I mean is, if I'm out for the rest of this week, then I will put another video out next week. I'll have to think of another way to put it. Maybe it'll be, I don't know. Give me some ideas. What If I can't give you running content, give me some ideas of what you'd like to see. Leave it down in the comments below. Have ordered a new pair of running shoes. They're not one of the latest pairs. They are an older model. Uh, I'm not going to tell you what, you, what they are. When they come... I'll make a little video and then I'll go through why I chose to go for those ones rather than the newest ones. Anyway, I'm going to uh, hobble off now. I'd say I'll see you on the next run, but at the minute um, we'll just leave it as we'll see you on the next video.